Ladies and gentlemen, for your delicacies of delight, I give you the Newman motor. What can I tell you about it? It's a motor. In the center, you have two ring magnets, which I took out of a microwave oven, spinning away happily, all wrapped up in plasticky stuff. On the outside, 600 turns of wire, also wrapped up in plasticky stuff. Uh, the wire resistance in total is 20 ohms DC. This in turn is being powered on a 6 volt battery. We just get a closer look at the connection here. And as you can see, my amateur consists of a piece of wire hanging onto the uh, contact. Getting an accurate current reading off this one is just not easy. It is up and down like a yo-yo. I've had it steady at around 18 milliamp at one point, but for some reason or other, it's not doing it this time. I don't think it helps a lot. The magnets are actually fixed, are not actually fixed very tightly to the screwdriver. So a flash you'd like to see is a neon being connected across the coil. So we know the back DNA from the coil is around 80 volts, not that it helps us much. So, can this thing produce over unity? I'll get back to you on that one. And go one last look. Remember